Did you know we could potentially reach other star systems within a human lifetime? The problem is massive. Our nearest stellar neighbor, Alpha Centauri, is over four light years away. With our current rocket technology, it would take over 70,000 years to get there. But theoretical physicists and engineers haven't given up. Enter the fusion rocket, potentially the most promising propulsion system for interstellar human travel. Unlike chemical rockets that burn fuel, fusion rockets would harness the same process that powers our sun, fusing hydrogen atoms to release enormous energy. This could theoretically accelerate a spacecraft to up to 10% the speed of light. At that velocity, we could reach Alpha Centauri in just 40, 45 years, well within a human lifetime. The challenges are immense, containing plasma at millions of degrees, developing materials that can withstand such extreme conditions, and carrying enough fuel for the journey. But several serious designs exist, like the British Interplanetary Society's Project Daedalus from 1978, or more recently, NASA's conceptual slough thruster. Even more ambitious is antimatter propulsion, which could reach even higher speeds by converting matter directly into energy through matter-antimatter annihilation. The efficiency would be nearly 1,000 times greater than nuclear fusion. The catch? Creating just one gram of antimatter would currently cost trillions of dollars and require more energy than all of humanity produces in a year. But technology advances exponentially. Just as flight seemed impossible before the Wright brothers, interstellar travel may be closer than we think. Perhaps you'll witness the launch of humanity's first interstellar mission, or maybe even board one yourself. What would you sacrifice to become an interstellar pioneer?